Hey guys, welcome to my first vlog. So I'm Anton Carlos from Pampanga. So ayan, I wanted to vlog. I wanted to try vlogging. So for my first vlog, na inspire ako yun na sa friend ko si Chino. What he did was an unboxing vlog from Vintage by Sweet Cutter. Okay, so di ako marun, di pa ako marun ng mag-vlog. I can do first legit vlog ko. So, alam mo mag-unbox. Ang unang gagawin is box to. Pero wala akong gamit na pang bukas. So, pupuha muna ako. Ang galing. Mag-unbox ako ng gamit. Boom! Hi guys. So, wala akong scissors. Scissors. Wala akong scissors. So, gamit ko ngayon yung secretain ko. Yung parang pen na pangpok. So, yung gagawin ko. Card. Bubuksan ko. So, paano ba mag-vlog? So, di ba ganyan? Okay. Hello, what's up? So, ganito ito ba? Ay, yung nga pala nakalimutan ko. Ito, it's 1,000 pesos. So, I think it's worth it na kasi super dami na yung nasa loob. So, let's see. Ay, tam. Tam. Tam nail, wala pa kong... Pinagawa ng mga YouTuber, di ba? Para may tam nail sila. Para ba? A few moments later. So guys, pagka-open nyo, ito yung makikita nyo. So, to clarify lang, yung 1,000 pesos, yun yung t-shirts. Um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7. So, 7 shirts for 1,000 pesos. I think, pesos, I think that's a good deal na. So, ngayon, tabi ko muna yung box kasi super bulky. Okay. So, isa-isa natin titignan yung mga shirts. So, balik ko ulit sa tripod. Joke, wala ang tripod. Okay, wait lang. So, hey guys. Yun, transition. Ang ganda na transition na. So, naisip ko, since di ko nga alam yung history or like background ng mga t-shirts sa mga to, I have decided na ano na lang. Um, I'll do a montage. Like, I'll show you every shirt. Tapos, papakita ka rin kung paano ko siya finit or like paano ko siya susuotin yung style ko I hope you guys enjoy so here it goes bye bye see you later okay yun ito na lang mas maganda ng transition to bye bye hey what's up guys so the first shirt that I got was a brown tee with a print of monument valley it wasn't that oversized so I decided to wear it as is and I went with denim jeans from Bershka and tan skate highs to go with it. Next up is a charcoal grey tee with a print of Long Beach State from TLC Sportswear which actually fits the same as the monument tee so I just used the same pair of jeans and shoes for the fit.
Third shirt is a gray Hanes tee with a print of ILWU, contract 2002, and based from the internet, I think it stands for International Longshore and Warehouse Union. I like the print in the back where it says, fight terrorism, not American workers. So this shirt was too oversized, so I decided to tuck it in and paired it with my Uniqlo pants and black DMs. So the next shirt is a black Tavik tee. I was surprised when I saw its retail price was around $40, so it means that it's absolute steel. I like its quality and it is really simple and easy to match. So I tucked it in as well and used the same plaid pants from Uniqlo and black DMs to complete the fit. Next up is a brown Harley Davidson shirt and it definitely gives a vintage vibes because of its overall design and it is also a pocket tee as you can see and I really like it and I'm excited to wear it after quarantine. I paired it with a different pattern of plaid trousers from Uniqlo and black DMs as usual. Hey, hey, hit the... Whoa! <laughs> What a sensation though! So the sixth shirt is a navy blue Disneyland tee with the print of Grumpy from Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. The text gives the vintage vibes and I find it really really cool. So I matched it with a moss green ankle pants from Uniqlo and my favorite black DMs. And the last shirt from the Mr. Box is the gray Al Selty, which has a print of a compass and hoist the colors. I don't know if I pronounced it correctly, but yeah. So I tucked it in as well with the same pants from Uniqlo and black DMs. So yeah, that's about it. So yeah, that's me dancing. Wait, oh there. Hey, hey, let's go. Hey, 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 hey. Oops. Hi guys, so as you can see, I'm wearing this outfit again. And that's because I think yung pinaka nagustuhan ko sa mga nakuha ko shirts sa mystery box. And I think it's super worth it, nasa 1,000 pesos. So again, shout out to Vintage Ways Keep Cutter for hooking me up with some mystery box. Actually, nag-message nga ako sa kanila na kagabi. Tapos, they replied agad. Tapos, I got the package agad then today. So, I highly recommend their store and their shop actually. So, I paired this shirt with some Uniqlo pants, DMs, and dapat long brown socks that I prefer ko, pero tinamad na akong mag long brown socks. So yun nga, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and please subscribe and shout out, shout out again to Vintage by Street Cutter and please, please, please stay home and stay safe and I hope to see you guys soon, especially your friends. Hope to see you real soon. Bye-bye.